Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we are going to be doing a map overview of Lone Tree, Colorado and talking about why this might be the perfect place for you to call home. My name is Cameron McClellan. I'm the owner of Colorado Team Real Estate based in Lone Tree, Colorado. If you're new to the channel, be sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any future episodes of neighborhoods, market updates, and new properties coming on the market. All right, so let's talk about location first. Lone Tree is a prestigious neighborhood located on the south side of Denver Metro. It's right here at the intersection of I-25 and 470. And so 470, it's a toll road if you head east. And then if you head west towards the mountains, that is not a toll road. And as you can see here from where you're sitting in Lone Tree, it's about 20 minutes to downtown Denver, just depends on the traffic. It's about 30 minutes over to Golden to get on I-70, access to downtown Denver, and then you've got um, access to 470 to come around if you wanna head up to the mountains. And then looking south down to Colorado Springs, you're probably about an hour 15 minutes down to Colorado Springs, northern side of Monument here, that's gonna be more like 45 minutes. And so um, Lone Tree has got a great location where you don't have to deal with a whole lot of the Metro traffic. Um, but you've got access to all the major roads so you can move around quickly. One of the things that's amazing about Lone Tree is the parks, easy access to parks and trails. And then also the majority of Lone Tree sits on the west side of I-25. So you've got amazing views of the Front Range. One of the most popular parks in Lone Tree is Bluffs Regional Park. And that's right here. It's this big open space right on the south side of Lone Tree. And I love coming out here early in the morning or late in the evening because this is really the high point on the south side of Denver Metro. And so when you're up there, you've got amazing views of the lights of Denver Tech Center and downtown Denver. And then you're watching sunset or sunrise come up, go down um, over to Rocky Mountains. So just a beautiful spot to go get a short hike in. You can be up at the summit in about 10 minutes. And what's cool is, if you live here on the south side of Lincoln, it's easy to just walk over there. And so you've got trails right outside your door. So you can go out, get outside. If you're in hiking or mountain biking, trail running, any of that stuff, Bluffs Regional Park is your place. And then that also ties into a larger trail system down through Highlands Ranch. So a lot of opportunities here for mountain biking, hiking, and trail running. One of the other parks that's really popular is Sweetwater Park. So Sweetwater Park, you can come over here. There's a nice little pond. There's trails, um, gym, gym for the kids to play on. And so that's one of my favorite parks to take my kids to whenever I'm hanging out in Lone Tree. There's also an amazing trail system throughout Lone Tree. So most of the neighborhoods that you're going to see, there's going to be trails that connect all those communities through open space. And so it's real easy to get on a trail system here, then connect up with the Highline Trail, which runs throughout Denver Metro. Lots of options to get kids out in a stroller or just go out for a jog, a walk, whatever it may be. Lone Tree is very friendly for outdoor recreation. Lone Tree is also a destination for people shopping and dining out. There's the Park Meadows Mall. Park Meadows Mall is one of the best malls in the Denver Metro area, and it has over 200 shops, tons of nice restaurants right there in that area. So right here at the intersection of I-25 and 470, there's the Park Meadows Mall. And so this whole district right here, there's tons of shops. There's a lot of specialty shops in the area as well, um, even an Ikea here in this shopping district. So tons of places to go out for a nice dinner or go get your shopping done right here. This is where a lot of people on the south side of Denver are coming to do their Christmas shopping or any shopping throughout the year. All right, so jumping off the map real quick, let's talk about schools. If you've got school age kids or maybe that's your plans for the future, Lone Tree is an amazing area for that. Whenever people talk about school districts in Denver Metro, Douglas County is one that's usually towards the top of the list. And so there's Lone Tree Elementary School. You can see here, got a very high rating for that. There's Eagle Ridge Elementary, um, Ascent Classical Academy, 
and Eagle Academy. So lots of options for school right here. Um, there's also open enrollment throughout the area. So there's opportunities to look at other schools, but you can count on Douglas County to be one of the better options for schools in the area for your kids. All right, so let's talk about real estate. Whenever you come to live in Lone Tree, this is considered a very clean, very prestigious neighborhood on the high end for Denver Metro. So as you can see here, we got homes all the way up in the three and high two million price point. And then if we serve by price down to the lowest, um, housing kind of starts right around 600,000. So some of these townhomes you're seeing right here, what's awesome about those homes is that they're very close to coffee shops and breakfast spots. So you can literally walk out your door and be on the trails or walk over to your favorite coffee shop to your favorite place to dine. And then as we move up in price point, a lot of these luxury homes that we are showing here, these are in gated neighborhoods and golf course communities. And so um, a lot of people love this area because you get a larger yard, you get a little more of an established neighborhood. So that makes Lone Tree feel like home immediately once you move in. All right, so in conclusion, Lone Tree is an amazing place if you're an outdoor enthusiast or you're looking to live around great shopping or dining, or you wanna raise kids in an amazing school district, this place is gonna be a good one for you to call home. One of the cons though, is that the pricing affordability for housing, it's high compared to the rest of Denver Metro. So that might be something you wanna consider. If you have any questions about living in Lone Tree or the surrounding areas, be sure to reach out. I love shooting these videos, but would love even more to help you find your next dream home in the Denver metro area. My name is Cameron McClellan. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any future episodes.